interesting shit to start off with. So there's pretty much been this big trending shit going on with uh, Adam 22's podcast and No Jumper podcast. He had Selena Powell on and her friend and her friend pretty much said some interesting ass stories that got the Internet buzzing and trending. Uh, she talked about slurping seven NBA players back to back to back to back all in a row, whatever them sitting in a hotel room. And there's a lot of rumors that it is the Phoenix Suns, but these are rumors. They're not, they're not from credible sources. And a lot of people might just be saying that shit because they went 8-0 and in the bubble. But I'm not buying that. I'm not spreading that. So don't take it from me like that. It is, don't, this is not confirmation that it's the Phoenix Suns. It's not confirmation by any means. So don't take it there. But let's listen to the interview. Since this was a YouTube interview on a YouTube platform, I'm probably not going to play the video. I don't want it to get demonetized or taken down completely. So... Let's just listen to the audio. On my birthday, my birthday is Memorial Day weekend. Uh-huh. On my birthday, I seen them all at Dre's, like this one team. Okay. She's so shy. It's just so cute, <laughs> I know, baby. I'm like, Shit. And I don't know. I was getting fucked in a hotel room. They all pulled up, <laughs> and I sucked their. Put them like down. The whole side. team. Seven. Seven basketball players in a row? Mm-hmm. How was that? <laughs> I was fucked oh up. God. I didn't fuck any of them, though. She said, what happened to the nuts? Swallowed. All of them? Yeah. And nothing happened? You didn't have, like, a, a weird reaction in your stomach or anything? No, no. I passed that out. That sounds so fun. You're, you're mo- almost making it sound like you were too fucked up to be sucking seven dicks. And also, you were getting no. fucked by somebody else right before this? Yeah, they walked in <laughs> mid me getting fucked. How did they walk the in? Where were you? In the hotel room. So I was fucking like someone that works with the team. And I know, I know that team because I've hooked up with them before. The but they team. all pulled up. No, not the whole team. <laughs> okay. Like a few of them. They all just pulled up. They knew I was in there and they were like, let's get lit. And they were just sitting around the bed and they just rotated. Wow. Yeah. That's tight. Yo, they all love you. So you don't Told look back. You. Do you look back at this as a positive memory? Yeah, I don't care. It was lit. Hell yeah. Yeah. I respect She's that. just nervous right now. No, I mean, she's not that nervous if she immediately told us about sucking seven dicks in a row. <laughs> That's facts. Can't be that nervous if you're divulging that type of information. Um, it's pretty filth <laughs> on her regard uh, for her to be doing that. And for all the seven NBA players back, you know, getting their dicks sucked all in a row, all seven of them all sitting in the same room on the same bed waiting and watching each other. That's pretty filthy. I could imagine it went something like this take me out it's my turn it is you told me it was my turn you can talk all that you want hey, to hey, yell and scream hey, you're okay, lost. it is my you're turn you lost the game it's my turn take as long as you want you're still lost <laughs> that's filthy i don't even understand like these girls come not even girls these thoughts come on this show and want to promote their whole behavior and it's like it's all for the clout this is like the clout wars out here. These girls come in. She, she hosts how anxious and how giddy Selena Powell was about. Oh, shit. This eyelash is fucking my shit up. Yeah, Selena Powell's been. She was so happy that she was telling these type of whole stories, the, her thought tales. Uh, and it's like. The clout, clout is really a, a motherfucker because this girl said she's a CPA. Imagine her returning back to her office and all these other accountants looking at her like, you did that, bitch. Like, Jesus Christ. Like, that's these girls are tripping. Like, I don't even know what to say about that. Like, for me, I look at people like this that are so thirsty to get these type of thought quest stories out there. It's like, why? People were so quick to jump and believe her story about Trey Songs. 